while I'm waiting, can I borrow that scarf? Gee, that's pretty. Can I just use it for a minute for an experiment here? What I'd like to do is just soak this in a little solution here. You don't mind, do you? What is your name? Noreen? Okay. We've got Noreen's uh, scarf nice and uh, wet here. I'll wring it out. And then I'll take uh, some tongs. You don't mind if I just set it on fire here for a minute, do you? <laughs> this is okay, isn't it? <laughs> it is burning. Everyone agrees, right? Thank you, Noreen. <laughs> Hold it up. Is it burned? Let the audience see. Now, how did I manage to do that? Well, I'll explain. A magician would just do this, right, and not tell you how? Magicians are going to hate me, right? Uh, you sometimes see magicians do this. The solution that I dipped it in was a solution 50% isopropyl alcohol and 50% water. Now, as you may know, alcohol burns at a fairly low temperature. And so, in fact, the alcohol ignited at a temperature below the kindling point of the cotton that the scarf is made out of. Furthermore, because the alcohol was mixed with water, the water took up some of the heat that was produced by the flame. And so the alcohol basically burned without the, uh, the scarf catching on fire. So that's a trick. Uh, you can perhaps do with your friends. It's ordinary uh, isopropyl alcohol that you would, uh, it's like rubbing alcohol that you get in the drugstore. So, um, it's an example of heat. 